Ini yang lebih Terus, why on earth are you going to this? And my, my automatic answer was that uh, there is something special Everybody is in harmony It is a very creative environment
time for the romantic in this country. And I feel very good that at least four or five here. So we are again in a minority trying to speak with our music to the heart. Transcendence and imminence. 
I, I think it's important with composing, you please yourself first. You hope to find other people who have more approximate musical taste. But you've got to please yourself first. It's never if you can get your shoulders to see what everyone else is doing. If you've got something to say, then you can get on the same. So what I have to say? <laughs> <laughs> I have wrote the same uh, and based on the same oil. Anyway, so I have no uh, answer <laughs> for your question. But so just I talk about I'm scared, and uh, I, I hope you say something from what I said. Thank you. I wish my Japanese <laughs> Sort of came out of left field, really, but once that had arrived, 
And my parents were very good at saying, well, maybe you should play something else, apart from sandbox. Yes. And so um, I then went, they encouraged me to sort of, you know, do that stuff. And by the time I was four, um, I was going in for our steppers in Wales, and I mean, I can't remember any of it, but I've got all the cups to prove it. I mean, I must have been so obnoxious. I mean, <laughs> in fact, so obnoxious that when I got to the age of six, I said to my parents, I'm not going to do this anymore. I'm fed up. I want to go out and play football. I want to go do what ordinary kids do. And to their immense credit, they said, all right, fine. That's what you want to do. That's fine. And within six months, I was begging to have piano lessons again. I miss it so much. Now, if they'd said to me, don't be so stupid, you've got a gift, you know, you can't, you, you've got to nurture it, you, you, you can't give up the piano, that might have changed my whole career because I would have then resented it. But I had to learn for myself how important it was for me. Yeah. It, was much, it was part of me. Yeah. And that's what taught it to me. Thank you. And in fact, I'm very welcome. In fact, my parents used to, their way of punishing me was to lock the piano. In. <laughs> and I, I remember going around to my friend's house, he had a piano, and I'd go around to my parents have got the piano in the game, and I'd go on your piano. Um, they didn't do it very often, to be fair. But um, that's how much it was part of me. I'm sure there are other people in this room, you know. Do you have a number four from your old material from a few years ago? Sometimes if I've written um, something that hasn't been for media, and I think it's a very good tune, and I will read cycle it. Hey, everybody! No, you cycle it. I can do it. Why can't I? Yeah, exactly. Could you explain in some way the relationship between a major and minor key within one piece? If you go. All of what's up.
Mm. I've never done this, but, so bear with me. Um, but if you suddenly put it into a mind, I mean, I, I think it feels quite uplifting, quite positive, quite optimistic, quite romantic. Um, it makes you feel good, doesn't it? I hope it does. It makes you feel like that the feel of it. It makes you feel life is kind of worth living, you know? I put it in the mind. Piece of original music. Does yes. it happen often to you? It has happened a, 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 a couple of times, but then you—it's very difficult to know whether to trust it or not. Yeah. You know. Yeah. But um, I mean, that's the other thing about being a composer. It's—it's it's like being a painter or a writer of novels. It's such an insular profession, um, and you have to really—it's very. I don't know. If other composers here feel the same thing, but. Very often you don't have that much confidence in what you've written. You think, is this really as good as I think it is? And then of course you have that terrible moment when you have to play it to other people. You know. <coughs> and then you, then you get quite good at gauging people are being polite or if they really like it. You know? And it doesn't get any easy. In fact, in a way, it gets harder because once you have a certain track record, once your career goes to a certain way, then the pressure becomes even more. I think, well, you could do it last time, but can you do it this time? You know. Um, so it's, it's, it's hard, but um, when you get it right, it's, it's fantastic. You don't write a man Oh, thank you.